we're gonna show you how to do an alpha braid. We love the wet brush. Clearly we used it a lot, it's unbelievable. You always start at the bottom when you're brushing long hair with a lot of pool tangles. This girlfriend has been swimming a lot. All right, we did it, Kenzie, we did it. We did it, did it, did it. Okay, I'm gonna make a little Elsa poof because one, it keeps her bangs out of her face and Elsa has some volume up top. So you just take a little bit of hair at the top and then I pull it back a little and then poof it. And then you take one bobby pin there and then cross the other bobby pin over that one. Ta-da! Pretty Kenzie. Okay, now Elsa's braid is to the side. And Elsa's braid also starts about halfway down. So we're just gonna start halfway down as well. This will be easy peasy. Three equal sections. And then I like to do Dutch braid because I think it gives it more volume. So you go under the middle instead of over the middle when you do it as a Dutch braid. So under the middle, under the middle. Collect some more hair. I'll go under the middle and collect some more hair. Oh, you okay? Go use these and come down and grab it and go under the middle. Pull this together. Okay, so now this guy's turn. I need to collect some more hair. Collect the hair and grab it. Okay. I take these two, remember? One more, I'll help you. And then go under, a little. Collect some more hair for this one. And then go under, a little. Okay. We're gonna start making sure that we can go over to this side. So let's just finish it out. Take the rest of the hair. Okay, grab it. Okay, we're gonna finish our braid. So, under, 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 under. That's it. Something that I like to do with the Elsa braid is to pull the braids. So you just grab the sides and pull the hair. Super easy and it makes the braid look even bigger and thicker. You just go like this. 